Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, my family, my relatives, my friends, my friends on Facebook, followers on Instagram and Twitter, and my subscribers on YouTube, let me talk to you. It is here, has finally arrived on the scene, episode 500 of my YouTube show called The People's Lima. I am your host, The People's Lima himself, Eric Lima. What is going on? I hope you're having a wonderful, fantastic day out there. You better enjoy the sunshine now because the rain's coming in, man. It's going to be ugly as heck. Well, today is going to be a thank you episode of the YouTube show. It's called Heartfelt Thank Yous. I'm going to thank a lot of people here. And a lot of people, I'm going to try and make this quick so I can make it short and sweet. And just to uh, let everyone know that um, this is... Without you guys out there, and without the people in my life before the internet, before I hit the internet in 2009, before, and there's a lot of people out there I want to thank. All right, I got my little book here from Old Navy Japanese uh, the Chinese Dragons on the cover. Um, I've written down people I want to thank, so it'll be a while. Trust me on this one. Take a good long episode. All right, uh, I'm gonna be religious on a couple of them. Just um, let me know. You know, first person, first and foremost, I want to thank the Lord Jesus Christ. And had not been for him, I wouldn't be alive today to spread uh, all my fun stuff and my humor to to all of you out there in the world who like watching my show. And believe me, I have I have I've been yeah, been having a lot of fun doing this. And just uh, and we there's a few haters along the way, a couple of haters, a couple of haters, as Enzo Amore would say. But you know what? I deal with it swiftly and justly. So thank the Lord Jesus Christ for giving me the wisdom and strength to do this. And uh, so yeah, 500 episodes, man. Unbelievable. I want to thank my family. I want to thank first my biological mother, Bonnie, who's no longer with us, but she gave birth to me. Um, Mom, I, um, to my biological mother, I love you. And uh, I know you're watching from heaven. I'm sure there's a computer up there. Probably they have internet. Probably Wi-Fi is free. Probably everything's working up to par. So I say thank you. All right. And to my father... Uh, Charlie, Dad, I love you, and uh, thank you for making me the man that I am. If it had not been you not giving up on me, I wouldn't be alive today. I wouldn't be here uh, doing this. And so, Dad, uh, I love you, and I thank you. And to my stepmother, Cheryl, Mom, I love you as well. You have inspired me to be a lot of things and uh, to help you know, discover a lot of new things, a lot of new stuff. And just uh, I am very thankful for, for you, and, uh, and I love you. And God bless, uh, bless my father with you. Me and my father with you and Cora, and uh, you know you've been a blessing on um, um, our to me to me and my father. And we want to say thank you for that. To my sister Cora, my brother-in-law Brandon, the Haskell family, my uh, nephew Trustin Cruz, aka TC, and my niece Eliana Mercy. You guys love me so much and maybe part of the family, uh, even though I usually go off on my own. I t <laughs> so I want to say even though then you still may be part of the family and make me feel welcome. I want to say thank you guys. And uh, I'm falling back. I'm falling back. I'm falling back. Oh, no. I'm going to fall down. <laughs> oh, no. I got the bed to back me up. So, uh, <laughs> so I want to say thank you guys so much. And I love you guys. And uh, you guys are totally awesome. And re I'm really proud of you guys. Seriously, I'm really proud of you guys. And I love you. And my other uh, brother, Tyler, and my sister-in-law, Danica, and the, and the Bye Bell family. I want to thank you guys so much. For being part of our lives, uh, me and my, my life as well, and uh, and the entire Bi Bi Bell family, Mr. and Mrs. Bi Bell, and uh, Grace and uh, Brett. I want to thank you guys so much for help and having our Lima family be connected with your family. And we want to say thank you so much for inviting us over to your house a couple of times. And uh, I know I'm looking forward to see you guys again in July. So been a lot of summertime fun. I'm looking forward to it. All right, and. And my other brother, Michael, and my sister-in-law, Lanelli, um, and my niece, Aaliyah. I'm proud of you guys. Guys, when you guys have been tested time and time again. Michael, I don't care how much annoying you can be. I don't, you know, despite what's happened in the past, Mike, I'm really proud of you. I'm really proud of you being the man you are. You always want to do what's uh, best for your family. I can't wait to see you guys again in July as well. It's it's going to be. I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be a lot of fun. I'll be praying for your safety each and every single day of your lives. Thank you. 
Uh, Mike, I'm really proud of you, and thank you for that. My sister Joel and her fiance Rob and the entire Green Greenlaw family, and I want to thank you guys, and Gussie included. Um, I had a great time this past Saturday of your graduation, Gussie. I want to say thank you for uh, having my family, my family there, being part of the part of the, the festivities and honor because they're a friend and family member as well. And just you know, Rob, you're gonna be part of our family pretty soon. I want to say just thank you for being a good guy to my sister Jewel. Jewel, you've been you've been listen, you've been, been through a whole lot, but you stayed strong, you stayed the course, and you never gave up. And you have my fa and you have us around, and I think that's the main reason why I think I'm really proud of you. Just keep on staying strong. You got a great support group, support system here in our family. And Rob, Joel, I'm really proud of you. Just keep on doing, doing. It. Thank you so much. And to my um, my four youngest sisters, um, Jaira, Jasmine, Jada, and Rebecca. You four girls are learning a lot from mom, and just you know keep on paying attention, listening to her. And set, set the good example that you're supposed to set. And I want to say thank you so much. Uh, you girls made me feel, you know, always love me as a big brother. Sometimes you may be highly annoying, but you know what? Your sisters, that's what they sisters do. So I want to say thank you guys, and I love you guys. My entire Lima family and our extended families. I want to thank my relatives. I want to, you know, I did this video the first time around. I thought I completed it, but then I had to uh, uh, delete it because... I forgot to thank a few more people. The Zimmerman family. Uh, my grandfather, Lynn. My grandmother, Carol. Uh, Grandpa, if it had not been for you, this computer, nothing would have happened. You know, nothing of, of this magnitude would have happened. So, Grandpa, Lynn Zimmerman, thank you so much. And I always I miss your sense of humor sitting at the dinner table. You're always cracking jokes. It was on Thanksgiving or Christmas or something like that. You always crack jokes. And uh, I know you guys are up in Maine. Uh, my Auntie Carla. And my cousin Elena, um, girls, thank you for your support, as well as uh, my Uncle Tad and Auntie Timmy, thank you for your support as well. And my cousins Cody, Wyatt, Ian, Timothy, thank you guys so much. And little Elizabeth, I got it, you know, and I miss you guys up. I, I know you've been far away from us, and hopefully you guys visit us while we visit you. I don't know how, how everything's going. Hopefully, I pray that everything will work out for the best, and, and everything's going to work out. I, I believe, believe it, but. Thank you guys so much. Uh, to my other relatives, my dad's side of the family, uh, my Uncle Johnny and my Auntie, uh, Auntie Debbie with my cousin Scott, Stacy, and Shane, and Shane and his fiance Lauren. Uh, I want to thank all of you guys right now. You guys are totally awesome. Uncle Johnny, I want to thank you for taking care of me when I was a kid. You know, I was a little rap scallion while my father was working uh, painstakingly, um, painstakingly uh, every day, working very hard to... Uh, you know, make my life great, and just uh, thank you for taking good care of me, Uncle Johnny. Uh, all those times watching Saturday morning cartoons, kid video, while playing Space Invaders, or freaking uh, go on and, and playing uh, Spider-Man pinball in your apartment uh, back in the day. So I want to say thank you, Uncle Johnny, and uh, you know, uh, Scott, Stacy, and Shane, especially Shane's, always making me feel welcome. Um, always, you're a great guy, Shane. Keep on doing work hard, doing what you do. And uh, you got a good woman, Lauren. Lauren, thank you for uh, being, making me um, part of your life as well. Just thank you, just uh, you know, and you're part of my cousin's life. And, and when you guys get married, let let me know. If you send an invite, man, I'll probably I want to be there just to to cut the rug on the dance floor to show everyone how it's done, Eric Lima style. You know what I'm saying? Um, my uncle Duart, and I know my late auntie Linda. I know she's no longer with us, but auntie Linda, thank you for um, allowing me to be, be in the home. To hang out with David and and Uncle Duart, I want to thank you uh, for being the man that you are. You know, you you remarried and you're a strong guy. Keep up doing what you're doing, man. You know, don't give up on your life. You know, so I, I love you, Uncle Duart. You are the man. Uh, to my cousins, uh, cousin Tina, her husband Jane, and daughter Kaylin. Um, you, I love you guys. You guys are awesome. Keep up the great work. You know, keep on doing what you're doing. Don't give up on life. Just you know, work hard. I'm really proud of you guys. You guys came a long way. My cousin, my other cousin David, his wife Jennifer, and their daughters. Guys, it's totally awesome. I know David, you've been part of my life as well. Whether it's we're playing remote control or you know or looking at baseball cards or whatnot, just you know, you're a good kid. You're a good man. You worked hard. You worked hard, and you and you, you're, we have a lot in common. We ha both hate snow, so keep up the good work, David. You know, and keep working hard. You know, and they take good care of Jennifer. I know you're a good. Husband and a good father, just keep up the great work. Um, 
my um my auntie Patsy and my and my uncle John uh, for Tato, um, Monty Patsy, what can I say? Every time my uh, va -voom, va -voom, took care of me and those and they had to, you know, work and all that, they sent me up to you guys and well, you, Tiff and Brienne, and whether I sit down, you know, turn on TV and watch Bullseye or The Joker's Wild or something like that. And uh, I want to thank you, Monty Patsy, for taking good care of me as well. And um, and I like my Vavu, I know he's no longer with us. Thank you for being there for me, Vavu. Uh, I know you're up there right right now in heaven, watching it on the computer along alongside my biological mother as well, uh, Bonnie. And you know, just you know, probably saying that's my friend. I'm really proud of him. That's my grandson. And so, thank you very much, Vava. Uh, uh, Vava, you are probably the strongest woman, and you know, you're over 90 years old. Congrats, you know, just I'm really proud of you, Vava, and just I love you. Uh, boss of us. That's all I gotta say on that. And um, my cousin Tiffany, my co my cousin Tiffany and her fiance Micah and their son Kyle. You guys are just awesome. Always made me feel part of the family. Always made me feel welcome. They always ask me how I'm doing. Always ask got me great questions. Keep it up. You know, keep getting trying to get. You know, if you want information from me, I'll be more than happy to give it to you. Just thank you guys so much. And you know. Um, Bree, uh, Brienne with her husband John and uh, and and Kaylin and uh, excuse me and the rest of the family. Family, you guys are just awesome. Love you guys. You're part of the family now, John, and you and your family are part of the family. I always believe that if you marry into my uh, with my cousins and all that, you're you're my cousin and so is your siblings and all that. Just thank you guys just so much. You guys are awesome, rocking awesome. Keep up the great work. And all your friends there. So that's all my relatives there. And it's a uh, bit crazy, you know. Uh, hey, hey, I'm a positive guy. I'm wearing my Bootios t-shirt. New day. It's a new day. I can't twerk in this chair. <laughs> I'll be following it. Whoa. Okay. Um, to my uh, church family uh, from uh, days of the Church of the New Testament in 84 till present of the New Seasons Worship Center uh, from uh, the Apostles to uh, Antonio and Reverend Beverly Resendiz, to to uh, pastors uh, David and Joanne Lima, and to and or well, Matt and uh, Matt and Ra Matt Resendiz, his wife Randy Leonard Resendiz, the uh, the entire uh, music ministry of the church, the sound ministry, uh, Paul Costa and his entire his wife Isabel, uh, daughter Paulette, son Marco, uh, son-in-law Danny, uh, boy uh, Steppers. Steppers, um, Lisa and Paul Valente, uh, Bob and Diane Ferreira, son Timothy, wow, uh, Chuck Leonard, and just want to thank all of you guys. Uh, you guys have been a blessing. The Marsh Assaults family, uh, boy, uh, who do I want to thank? The Wombolts, the Brums, everybody. I want to thank everybody from from back in the day. The Hasey family, uh, Sean, Eddie, and Lisa, uh, Jason Blanchett, oh uh, boy, a lot of people. I want to thank. Like I said, I don't want to take up a lot of time. Just the, from the folks, also from the churches that associate with our churches, from uh, the you know, Church of the Firstborn to to Pastor Gilly Goliath's church and his family as well. Thank you guys so much for being a part of my life. You got my brothers and sisters in Christ, and you guys are just totally awesome. I love you guys. You know, you guys helped me, inspired me to do do this show, have a lot of fun with it, and just so I want to say thank you guys so much. You guys are an inspiration. Uh, just to thank you, everybody, my church family, brothers and sisters in Christ. From Church of New Testament, New Season Worship Center, New, uh, Church of the First, more Redeeming Family Church, Cross Point Church, uh, Pastor Stephen and his wife Mary, and just everybody, just thank you guys. You guys, have, God's blessed me with you guys, and I'm sure He's blessed you with me. And I want to say thank you guys so much. You guys are awesome out there. Uh, to my Ruby Tuesday alumni family from 1995 to the year I uh, worked at. I quit, and that would be 2010 for the 15 years I've worked there. You guys, it's just totally awesome. I can go down a list of who I want to thank. Uh, the management teams, Joe Monger, Christopher Vieira, Tony Barra, uh, Mike Sylvia, Anthony Martone. Um, wow. Uh, and Junior Candida. Um, wow. There's a lot of people. Christine Hall, Sherry Crossley, Carolyn Hallcroft, Poppy Pierce, Kelly Howland, Shelby Sylvia, Corey Sylvia. Oh, Lord. Jessica Rondo. Oh boy, there's a lot of people out there I want to thank and just um uh, it's it's it was knuckle up time. Just want to thank everyone 
from the Ruby Tuesday crew. You brought me a broader personality out in me. Brought me some few sides I never experienced as far as you know the sides and emotions of me I never experienced before. But I want to thank you guys for making me feel welcome and part of your lives as well. You guys are just totally awesome. The Ruby Tuesday Dartmouth family from 1995 to 2010. I want to thank you guys so much. And like I said, this episode is dedicated to you. Uh, to my friends on Facebook, from Angel Bailey, Norm Waymer, uh, a lot of people, a lot of people. I want to thank a lot of people. Um, you know, what is we have rest, uh, common with wrestling, uh, New England sports, Power Rangers, video games, game shows. There's a lot of people I want to thank there. Uh, my Instagram and Twitter followers, thank you. I know a lot of women follow me. Uh, it just amazes me how many women follow me on Twitter, and just I'm not the best looking guy, so I said to the ladies and also on Instagram, thank you for uh, making me feel, you know, like I'm I'm am worth something, and I'm, I'm somebody, you know, just you know, not just some ordinary you know goofball kid, and a goofball guy, and just um, and to my uh, subs there on some of my uh, subscribers here on YouTube, I want to thank you guys. I know Captain Aronius was no longer a subscriber. I did not block him or kick him out. He off to the lead, but Captain Aronius is giving you your first shout out. Say thank you. Uh, I know we have a lot in common with the Patriots and all that. Uh, Thomas Willis is another guy I want to thank. Uh, local boy, you know, it was great seeing you the other day. Uh, hope we run each other more when I'm not working. We can sit down and talk or have a chat or something like that. Uh, Jason DeCanio for helping me out do battle, uh, do battle against trolls and haters and just how to deal with them and all. I want to thank you. And Robert Johns, no longer a troll, no longer a hater. He's part of my subscribers, um, he's decided to stop fighting me and Jason to fight the real enemy. I want to say thank you, Robert. You're a good man. Um, if there's anything you want to know, let me know, and I will help you out. And I know you're not understanding a lot of things going on, but don't worry. I got your back. I got, you know, Robert Johnson, you're a good guy and everything else. And so, great, Jason DeCanio, uh, thank you for um, being the guy that you are, helpful, and um, you're, you're an awesome dude. So, Jason DeCanio, Robert Johns, thank you very much. And that is all the time we have on the show. Remember, just because I've reached 500 episodes, doesn't mean I'm stopping there. There's a couple more things I want to talk about. They'll be on my next episode, 501 Levi Jeans. No, no, I'm kidding. It was a little joke. No, uh, so a lot of stuff's going on. A lot of stuff's going down this summer. Can't wait to tell you all about it. Tell you all the crazy stuff that's been going on, whether it's Raw, SmackDown, all the craziness in the world. And there's a coin. Yep, and there's a coin. Woohoo! Okay, and uh, and just uh, I'm just really excited. Just uh, excited moment, man. Excited moment. So, uh, oh, also, also want to thank the folks from the Latchkey programs uh, back in the day. Uh, Joe Nevs, Sean Hargraves, Karen Chin, Gina, Gina DiBattoli, Galaza. Oh uh, boy, you know the late great Susan Manning. Uh, all the crew chat career. All, all you guys out there, thank you for uh, helping me be, uh, discover more of a personality of myself from back in the day. My love for music. Uh, helped me uh, discover my love for music in the 80s. And to this day, I love music in the 80s. So that is, like I said, that's all the time we have on this show. Oh, uh, boy. A lot of things. That's a cr more crazy things going to happen. I'll tell you more about it on my YouTube channel. And on my, for my show, just because I reached 500, that doesn't mean I'm going to stop there and tell all you trolls and haters, go fly a kite. All, that, all trolls and haters out there, make it like a walnut mushroom and get a life. Oh, you know what I'm saying? And uh, and remember, uh, remember, this milestone achievement would not be possible without a few obstacles. It's a big deal. And um, remember, coolness is the essence of a happy person. Thank you so much for tuning in. 500 is now complete. I have reached a goal. Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> See ya. Bye. Peace. Till the next episode.